The first recipe in our menu is cabbage with oxymeli. Oxymeli is very simple to make. It is honey and vinegar. What we must pay attention to is to add the honey about half a cup. Bring to the boil and skim if necessary. To that we will then add two spoonfuls of vinegar, red vinegar. We will let it thicken and allow cooling before using it on the cabbage. Right, two spoonfuls of vinegar. And we let it simmer a little bit, as the ancient recipe says. It should be cooked with the honey. The oxymeli is ready, so we put it to one side to cool. Then we have the cabbage, which we shred. We put it in a bowl. Sprinkle with a little salt. And soften it a bit with our hand and then put it aside. In the cabbage we will add lots of finely chopped fresh coriander, a herb used extensively in ancient Greece, and rue. We have given proof many times that it adds a good flavor and stresses the cabbage's flavor. We take its leaves and chop them finely. Do not be afraid of its bad smell. And we mix it again with the cabbage. And we are ready to serve it later when we have the rest in our plates. We are ready to prepare the bulbs. The bulb is an unusual vegetable which may turn out bitter if you are not careful. Of course, there are those who prefer bulbs to be bitter. This depends on people's taste. We will show you here how bulbs were prepared in ancient Greece. The bulb must first be put into a bowl and we must have boiling water to pour over all the bulbs with the boiling water. We leave them there for about two to three minutes. Then we drain them and put them in another bowl and we cover them with rough salt for about six hours. Then we flick the salt away from the bulbs and place them in a jar.
και τους βάζουμε σε ένα βάζο. Έτοιμοι. The bulbs are ready. We take our onion, slice it in thin slices. Put it in the small saucepan. Here we will add a glass of vinegar. A spoonful of sesame, four spoonfuls of honey. We will put this on the fire. Almost bring it to the boil. Not exactly to the boil. We take it off before it starts to boil. The mixture is ready, as we said, before it starts to boil. We pour all the mixture over the bulbs. A little olive oil on top. We close our jar, put it aside to cool, and then we can either keep it in the fridge or leave it on a shelf. <laughs>